So this mystery angle is part of this four-sided figure over here. And how many degrees are in a four-sided shape? We could figure that out by using the formula 180 times n minus 2 to find the total degree measure of this polygon. And this formula could be used for any polygon. There are four sides in this figure, so it's just going to be 180 times 4 minus 2, which is 2. And 180 times 2 is 360. So there are there is a total of 360 degrees in this figure. Now how do we get this mystery angle? We already know two angles. We know 40 degrees and we know 90 degrees, but we still need to know this angle in order to get mystery angles. How do we do that? Well, let's look at this triangle over here. We have a right triangle and a square just indicates a right angle, which is 90 degrees. How many degree measures are in a triangle? If you plug that into the formula, it's going to give you 180. So 180 minus 90 is 90. So that is going to be the sum of these two angles. And these two sides are congruent, which means that the angles opposite to the sides must also be congruent. Congruent. So these two angles are congruent, meaning they have the same degree measure. And if they have to add up to 90, then we just do 90 divided by 2, which is 45. So the measure of each of the angles is 45 degrees. And this angle and this angle form a line. In a line, there are a total of 180 degrees. So to get this angle over here, we just subtract 180 with 45, and that's going to give us 135. So the measure of this angle is 135 degrees, and now we could put it all together. To get mystery angle, we take the total degree measure of the four-sided figure, 360, and subtract it with 40 plus 90 plus 135. 40 plus 90 plus 135 is going to be 265. And 360 minus 265 is 95. So that is going to be the measure of the mystery angle.